Hi guys, I know it's been forever since I recorded a video and I'm sorry about okay and now my phone's going off. That's just fabulous. Anyways, um so like I was saying it's been forever since I recorded a video and now I have a lipstick collection video for you guys break down into three categories because I only have nine lipsticks that I actually use. If I have any other ones, they're lost in the abyss because I don't even use them. So let's get started. Okay, so first category is Maybelline. I've created these generic like swatches that are on this like green lined paper just so I can know what I'm talking about. Maybe if I move that light, you guys will be able to see this better. Okay, you guys see that? Yes. So, the first two lipsticks I'm talking about are going to be from the new Popsicle Collection. Um, the Color Sensational Limited Edition Popsicle Collection. And they come in these hot pink containers. They're really bright neon. And I have two of the colors. I have 120 Citrus Slice and 100 Pink Lollipop. I actually bought two of the Pink Lollipops because I wanted to make sure I had a backup so I'll do the citrus slice and these what these are is they look like this and it is essentially a clear lipstick can you guys see that so at first I thought it wasn't really gonna give you much color but it gives you like this really pretty stain on your lips that's really freaking gorgeous which you really don't get the full effect of it on your hand. I actually haven't worn the Citrus Slice one yet on my lips out, so we'll have to see how that one goes, but I'm sure it's beautiful. But I have worn the Pink Lollipop. It is my favorite of the two so far, but we'll have to see. That might change when I wear the Citrus Slice one. But here are the swatches on my hands. This one is the, um, this one right here is the uh, Citrus Slice. You guys can't even see it. But then the pink one that you see over here is the pink lollipop. So the citrus slice isn't as um, uh, pigmented, I guess, on your hand. And then the last Maybelline lipstick is Coral Luster 840. And this is a gorgeous coral lipstick. And this, I don't remember what the collection is, but it was like some pearly collection. And it comes in this like really pretty like purple rainbow iridescent type packaging and this is coral luster and it's such a pretty like orange coral and it has the most gorgeous sparkle in it like ever like here it is right here you guys see that here it is right here and when you shear that out on your hand, the sparkles are amazing because I swatched it on my hand in the store and I just put it down. I was like, nah. But then I like was rubbing it off and I was like, oh my gosh, the sparkles, I have to have this. So yeah, let's move on to the next category. Next is Wet and Wild. Here is my generic swatch sheet right here. So I have one of the black tube lipsticks, and this is in 901 BP, and these are $2.99 or $1.99, I believe, and then the regular silver tube lipsticks are $0.99, cents. but you can always get them on sale for $0.69, cents, like almost all the time at Walgreens. So like I said, this one's in 901 BP, and it looks like this. Um, here is a swatch. And it's just a really pretty baby pink, but these can be like really drying and they kind of settle into the cracks of your lips sometimes. Um, this one is more towards just really drying effect, so I put a really pretty ba creamy baby pink lip gloss over it and it's like gorgeous, no problem. But here is the lipstick alone. It's very highly pigmented, as you guys can see. That is this one right here. So there's that swatch. And then I have two silver tube lipsticks, and this one is my very, very favorite. Um, I don't know if it's a necessarily a dupe, because I've never seen it in person, but, like, it really reminds me of the anime, um, 
OCC lip tar. When you put on your lips, it is like BAM. And everyone tells me that I look like a character out of an anime when I wear it. So it just really reminds me of that. It's so freaking gorgeous. Or like, I've never seen Candy Yum Yum, but like this seems like it might possibly be a dupe for Candy Yum Yum. So if any of you have Candy Yum Yum, try comparing it to 511B by Wet n Wild and just see what happens because I would love to know. But yeah, it's a super, super, super pigmented, gorgeous, hot pink. And it's pretty glossy on my hand, but it actually dries pretty matte. And if you would like sparkle, you can put the, um, some gloss on it or something. But I like the matte finish, and I noticed that it lasts ages. So there is the swatch. And as you guys can see, it is hot, hot, hot. It is this one right here. Hot, hot, hot pink. And then my last one is like the only ready lipstick I own. I have a couple corals because I'm really getting corals lately and I have almost all pinks and then I have like one little red lipstick. And this is actually 520E by Wet n Wild and I actually quite like it. It's more of a pinky red, it's not full on red. I don't really wear this one that often. I think I wore it once. But I still like to have it in my collection in case I ever feel like wearing it. So here it is right here. It's like a pinky orangey red, like I don't know. It's coming up a lot more orange on the camera than it is in real life. I don't know, maybe that'll help, but sha, let's move on. The final category is miscellaneous. I only have one of all of these brands of lipsticks. So we have the CoverGirl. Um, I believe this is the Queen Collection. Don't murder me if it's wrong, but yeah. And sorry that there's like ink on like my hand. It's from Art Stuffs, so yeah. But anyways, this is um the CoverGirl Queen lipstick I have, and this one is in 395 Darling, and it has the French name, and it says Chavery. And this one is awesome. I love it. It's such a pretty pinky nude color in the tube. But on me, it just comes out as a really pretty pink on my lips, so I have a good swap in lips. Oh my gosh. No. And then <laughs> So got this. Right, so. And so I love it. Next we're moving on to NYC and this is in the color 316 Blossom and this lipstick looks jacked, y'all. Look what happened to it. I don't even know what happened. It's just Mm. Shameful. I bought this one forever ago and I don't really ever wear it anymore but it's super pretty. It is a blue tone pink with really nice shimmers. So, da -da. Mm -hmm. so there it was in a few different lights for you. And then I have this generic lipstick that looks so random. Look at this. Look at this. Fail. But it's actually a really pretty color. I can't tell you the brand. I can't tell you the... Oh, 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 snap. This is a fashion lipstick in the color 1. Yeah. So, but none of you guys can get your hands on that. That's how limited edition this is. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. Anyway, here is a sis swatch. And it is this one. So there is my swatchy swatches on my handy hand. So that was my lipstick collection. I hope you guys enjoyed. I think that I mentioned in one of my previous videos that I was going to have a haul coming up, but yeah, that didn't happen because I have to use my dad's laptop to record these videos if you guys want them to be in this halfway decent quality. So therefore, I wasn't able to record on it forever. So here we are today making this video after like 3,000 years. So yeah. And my hand is all awesomely swatched for you guys. And sorry if you guys think my hair is messy, but I woke up and I'm like, 
recording and I really like it like this so yeah just so you guys know this isn't natural this is like it's straightened so it's crazy but it's awesome and it won't be this color anymore I'm getting the um colors and not that color no gosh anyways I'm gonna get the orange part of my hair dyed to this brown part that's at the top because this brown part's my natural part. And then my bangs I'm getting dyed blonde because I'm gonna dye them pink. And then the bottom half of my hair is black. If you guys can see, it's black down here. So I'm just gonna have the roots on this touched up because they're grown out like 50 feet and stuff. And this is all happening on Saturday. Saturday, Saturday. And I'm going to get my, whoa, Sally, and I'm going to get my nails done today because I go to school on Monday for the first day of the year. So peace out, people. Go get yourself some lipsticks. And these um, popsicle lipsticks were available at Reutide. So you guys better go hurry up and get you some before they go. The only other guru I saw mention them is um, Mac Barbie 07. So hopefully they're not all gone already. So go get yourself some, buy you some backups because they are limited edition and stuff like that. So peace!